I'm like, bro. She got, she got a kid. Look at his back. Oh my god. <laughs> Welcome back, LVB. We're gonna be reacting to this of Joey Diaz. Yeah, uh, Joey Diaz, definitely a savage, man. Uh, love watching him, he's funny as hell. Hey, man, if you get big enough on the podcast, you gotta get him on. Gotta get him on. Gotta get him on. That'd gotta be on. great. That'd be. It's like having a god with you, bro. Yeah, I don't know what type of god he is, but he's he, he's all the damn place. Yeah. If you're enjoying the reactions, man, hit the like button, subscribe, and share, bro. It's a road to 10K now. 10k. We're hoping to hit that by the end of uh, 2021. But uh, we finna rinse this video soon. Well, John, I didn't give it to him. He's got rules. Yeah, yeah, yeah you gotta give him that. He's got like a line in the sand. This is crazy. He's got a number. Currently, is a fucking crazy animal when you sit at home at night and you think about all the shit we've seen. We've learned a lot. I don't think I ever laughed as hard. Well, that's probably the second road. time right there. On that road, we learned a lot of things. You learned a lot of things about human beings. You learned a lot of things about individuals. You learned some crap. I don't know why I did uh, American Home. It's a, 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 a armed forces place in Idaho. It's part of the Triple Run. This is, I walked in and I had to go meet, do a sound check. Everybody kept looking at me going, Hi, how are you? Have you met Sandy yet? And I go, No. And they go, ah. And they go, <laughs> away. You ever see, uh, what's the movie with Eddie Murphy, when he, uh, with Boomerang? Yeah. When he goes to the black chick's house, it's 80, and the butler keeps laughing. Remember the butler would go, yeah, she wants to see you in the kitchen, and he'd go, <laughs> because she knew he was gonna, she was gonna rape him. So every time somebody was referring to Shirley, they'd go, have you met Shirley yet? And you'd go, no, and they'd go, oh, and they'd walk away. Well, Shirley, whoever the captain of that base was, the head of the base, she was his wife. And if a band came to town, or a comedian came to town, she blew him. That's it. That was the rule. <laughs> the right of passage. <laughs> he, he would sit up there with his fucking military on, with all his shit, and clap. And she'd be in the back, Sue Color Mink. the whole band. I mean, this is crazy. <laughs> so I didn't know about this. She came over and started talking to me. And then she started talking, oh, you're Cuban. I think the Cuban one time, he had such a big dick. You have a big dick? I mean, it was that quick. Like, it was that quick. Like, she just gets to it. She's like 50. I was maybe like 31. She was maybe 50. Wow. And she just dropped behind the curtain and took the hammer out. I started Sue Color Mink. I'm sitting there minding my own business. And all of a sudden, somebody comes yelling for her, Shirley, Shirley, Shirley. Now, usually, Shirley would get up and stop sucking your dick. Not Shirley. Uh, she moved her knees. Like, I had knee on belly. Right. You know somebody puts knee on belly? You're supposed to move this way? Right. That's what she did with her knees. She kept sucking and just kept moving this way. Right. She, I tried to take it out of her mouth. She wouldn't let it. She's like, no, no, no. She fell. Oh, oh, God. God. I mean, like, Shirley. She got it. Dude, spin wash your spin cycle. <laughs> I'm overstimulated. <laughs> They cut it short. What is the word? What does it mean? Minka means suck my dick. Minka in the dialect of the town. Suka means right. suck. Right, okay. You know, it's so weird how the more you go... Is this Spanish? This is Italian. Sicilian. Really? So the deeper you go down the boot, the more... Is it closer to Spain? Or is it farther from Spain? The closer Italy is from Spain, when people from that area speak Italian, I don't care how fast they're talking, they can't put the wool over me because I can pick up every four words. Oh, right. So Sicilians say suka. What's suck in Spanish? Chupa. Chupa. You're in the neighborhood. Right. Suka la mink. When they say suka la mink, yeah, like, like, you know, well, what are you going to do to that? I'm going to go and get my mink, you suck. But suka la mink is just the short. Oh, that's your, hey, that's short your second version. shirt of this show. Suka la mink. Oh, sure. Mm. And then you got mink, your juice. <laughs> what? <laughs> Uh, it comes at you however you want it. Him, like, he's like, when I think of, like, the Cuban athletes, like, Cuban super athletes, you think Yo Romero, right? Well, the, the thing that, the, the most thing that he has about being a Cuban is that he's 38, and you don't really know. 
Oh, yeah, man. Oh, he's 38. He could be 22, dog. He could be sucking you <laughs> in. Nobody really knows. Yeah, dude. Joe Romero. Joe Romero. He's just picking age. We want to be 38. Done. You know, he could be Dude, a Cuba. wrestler for a long time. So Crazy. It was a certain age. Oh, this season, but, but I know he's always like, something with the Q. I remember when my yeah. mom got I told my aunt, she's like, how old is your mom? 48. Fuck. She's been 48 for 10 fucking years. <laughs> you know, because it's true. You don't know, dog. You never know these motherfuckers' ages. They won't tell you. You know, that last fight, he fought fucking great, man. But, Did you see the one before that? Where he told people to not, he was trying to say, "Don't forget Jesus." Right. But but they they didn't get it because he's got a thick thick Cuban accent, the thickest. So he goes, "Don't forget Jesus, don't forget Jesus." So he, people thought he was saying, That's "No, great forget Jesus." Like, no, no forget Jesus. Jesus. Like Jesus isn't gay. It could have been way worse though. But like, when all Jesus. he was saying was forget, don't forget Jesus. He was saying, "Don't forget Jesus." He was just saying. You know, I won. Don't forget Jesus. You know why I didn't go to the way in? Why? You know why I didn't go to that way in? Why did you not go to that way in? Because I would have gone off on him. <laughs> like, he would have beat up Jacare, right. Luke, and I don't want everybody on that ring that night. I know how to motivate Cubans. Yeah? Or with, with religion. They're radicals. Man. That's what you would do? You would just start talking about God? I just talk about Ogun, the god, metal god of Cuba. He the looks metal? Wait a minute. Hold on. There's a god <laughs> hold in Santa Maria. There's a god Ogun. <laughs> And he's the one that, he's the metal worker. He's the fucking built. When you go on YouTube, look for a goon, he's always a big, yoked black guy that lives in the jungle. And he only comes out the f uh, He only comes out when there's a problem. So if I would have seen you all Romero that day, I would have said, oh, goon. I would have got his blood going. Oh, my God. <laughs> blood going, shit. <laughs> Dog, I started doing that to Anderson Silver when I first met him. And I remember one day in the hallway, he couldn't take his eyes off me. People were talking to him, they kept looking back, what that motherfucker saying? Because it's big in Brazilian, that <laughs> shit is big in Brazilian. So I would have started saying, oh yeah, do the hijo goon, oh yeah, okay. And then I would have started saying who my mother is. Whoa. Yo soy hijo, la santísima calidad de cobre. Y te estoy diciendo que le tiene que meter leña. Yo te estoy diciendo que le tiene que meter cayetazo hasta por gusto. That's the dude? That's Joe Romero. Look at him. That's he does look like him. That's, no, all black muscular Cuban dudes that look like that, you f fire them up, tell them they're a goon son. That's a goon son and shit. I'll get you wow. fucking fired up with all those images. I've never heard this before. This, this is right. huge and cute. Uh, yeah. Hey, Joey Diaz. Funny as hell as always, bro. Making him go Super Saiyan, bro. <laughs> yeah, you trying to do like oh that, man. You late to a god, bro? Yeah, uh, if you're enjoying the reaction, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, and share, bro. We got a Patreon coming soon for all of y'all. We're going to be reacting to full comedy skits, whole hour comedy skits. Uh, our podcast is going to be up on there. We're going to, like, upload, like, little highlights and clips up on YouTube and stuff like that. But we're going to have, um... George Carlin reactions, all that. Lecture reactions to Jordan Peterson. Uh -huh. So make sure you be on the lookout for that. It's coming soon. But we'll see you next time. That would be peace. No.